So, good evening everybody. Great to have you all here. Hi there, Valentine. Hi, Manji. Hi, SSV. Hi, Ollie and Manji again and Oksana and Nora and Hadi and Lucia and SSV and Chulo Diaz as well if you're still here and Zubz as well. So, wonderful to ha have you all here. Um, let's see, the stream tomorrow will be at 1pm, 3rd of February, <laughs> I, okay, I'll put it twice, hi there Vitali, um, next stream tomorrow, Saturday, 3rd of February at 1pm UK time, okay, lovely to have you, yo Leffy, lovely to see you, hi Rupert as well, and Manisco. Hey, great to have you all here. Okay, so let's get straight down to it. Hey, Manu, buenas tardes, que tal tío? Hey, back, yeah, back at the beginning, that's great, Manu. Okay, so, hmm, in an instant, everything changed. In an instant, everything had changed. Twinkling. Jack, good timing, Jack. Perfect timing, Jack, I should say. So, in an instant, everything had changed. Twinkling, meaning an instant. Shalom, Renyard. Lovely to have you as well. Yeah, so, in an, in an instant, twinkling. That's it, Vitali. Well done. You could say that, SSV, but the, the full bit is better. Yeah. Okay, well done, Hadi. Okay, yeah, in A, A or the. I think you could use both A or the. Yeah. Patricia, lovely to have you. Great to have you, Patricia, as well. And well done, Lionheart. It's lovely to see you as well, Lionheart. In the wink of an eye. Normally, Nora, we say in the blink of an eye, yeah? Wink is one eye and blink is two. We normally say in the blink of an eye as opposed to in the wink of an eye. Hey, in an eye's twinkling. Aditi, lovely to see you as well. In a twinkling, you could say in a twinkling. And Rainyard, in the blink of an eye. It's exactly the same idea, Rainyard. Yeah? Hey, twinkle, twinkle, little leffy. In the twinkling of an eye. That's very good. So, let me put this here then. Okay. In the... In the blink of an eye. Yeah, in the twinkling of an eye. In the... I think we could also put A here as well. You can... This is the same as in the blink of an eye. Yeah, you can put blink or twinkling. Both work. Very good, Patricia. In the twinkling of an eye. I love it. Yeah, yeah twinkle, twinkle, little Leffy. <laughs> or little Robin, more likely. Okay, so... I forgot to actually paste the last one in the... Um, chat box. So here goes with this one. It just makes it easier for you. In the blink of an eye, in the twinkling of an eye, Manu. Okay, we have begun to encounter technical problems. Hey, that's it. That's it. Hey, Manji. <laughs> Little Robin. In the switch of a blade. Oh, I quite like that. In the twerking of an eye. In the twerking of a bum, more likely, Leffy. Okay. Mm, almost SSV. Almost. So, in the blink of an eye, in the twinkling of an eye. So, but we've just encountered them. We've just encountered them, Vitali. So, the right tense. Nathaniel. We have, well done, Nathaniel. So, well done, SSV, and well done, Nathaniel. I love it. Welcome, Nathaniel. I haven't seen you here before. Come against. I would come up against. In the wink of an eye. No, in the blink of an eye. Not a wink, in the blink. We have come against. No, it needs that up. That's it, Hadi. Well done, Hadi. Well done, Lucia. Yeah, this... This is for non-native speakers, but it's, a, it's not easy. It's for people of very 
High level, Nathaniel. We have stood against. Jack, come up against. That's better, Jack. He wants to watch Baby Shark instead of this class. <laughs> I'm not surprised. Okay, so we stumbled against. I think stumbled against would actually work, Renyard. Let's see. Ollie says we've come up against, come up against for Aditi as well and for Patricia. We've been up against. But that means it was in the past. It started in the past and we've resolved them if you're going to use a present perfect. Yeah? Great to have you, Nathaniel. Vaishak. Lovely to see you, Vaishak. Yeah. Okay. There was a twinkle, a twinkling in his eye. There was a twinkle in his eye. Okay. In this one, I would say either run or come up against yeah we've run up against technical problems we've come up against technical problems so jack i would say there was a twinkle in his eye okay let's try the next one then and here we go oh i like this next one this is one i use from time to time these two situations are very similar six we have been up against technical problems but notice if you say we have been up been up against it means we have resolved them now whereas in this case we run up against them we come up against them we've just met them we we've just encountered these problems um and that's why run up against or come up against we have been up against various problems but we have resolved them whereas the run or the come indicates we suddenly found them Gremlins in the system. I love it. Yeah. There are always gremlins in the system. Well done, Vitali. Well done, Vitali. That's very good. You nailed it, Vitali. I love it. So, let's, let's see who else get, knows this one. It means the two things are absolutely the same. So no, notice, Jack, these two situations are very similar. These situa two situations are... So how, ma how many is half a dozen? A dozen is 12. That's it, Lucia. Well done, Lucia. <laughs> a half dozen of a time. So no, we need we need to we need Vitali's answer. It's this is this is a very clearly an idiom. These two are the same thing. Okay, you can also say um, these two situations the same difference. Swings and roundabouts. Six is half a dozen. Obviously, exactly, Rainyard. And, that, and that's the point. Yeah, these two situations are swings and roundabouts. This is another way of saying it. Yeah? Okay, so six is half a dozen, as Reynard puts it. And therefore, the two are exactly the same thing. <coughs> okay, so these two situations are the same. Yeah, there is no difference between them. Okay, I think I'm going to write this one because I think I've found one here that most of you don't know. These two, two situations are... and half, That's it exactly. That's the idea, Oksana. These two situations are six of one and half a dozen of the other. Six of one and half a dozen of the other, Aditi. So you, you would say it's a real mouthful. Mm, yes, but people do say it. Um, these two situations are swings and roundabouts. Very often you just say swings and roundabouts on its own. Um, to make it sweet and short, you make it sweet and short. So these two situations are six of one and half a dozen of the other okay so these two are the same okay let's try the next one there 
Ooh, this is what one I like that come is a canal one. Okay. So avoid it at all costs. Yeah, don't go near it. Don't touch it. Yeah. So I thought I'd, I thought I'd put some harder idioms in today. Well done, Vitali. Yes, swings and roundabout mean similar. Exactly. Yeah, the swings and roundabouts. These are two attractions at the fair, or two attractions in a playground where um, the the kids go. So very good, Vitali. Very good, Nathaniel. Well done, Leffy. Well done, Manji. And well done, Renyard. Now the supplementary question: How long is the barge pole? How long is the barge pole? Okay, well done, Hadi, well done, Nora, well done, Lionheart, well done, Lucia, that's the idea. But now, the supplementary question. You don't need the... I, 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 I don't touch it even with a barge pole. You could use the even, but how long is the barge pole? How long? <laughs> yes, I did put a lot harder ones. Six of one, half a dozen of the other. Yes, Nathaniel. I, I think very often you don't have to put the an. an. Yeah. Aditi, absolutely. It's very cold and very wet, Leffy. Go to Cheney Walk in London. Cheney Walk. You'll find some really good barges to live on there, Leffy. Yeah. So, with a barge pole. Notice pole, 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 a long stick. Well done, well done, Oksana. Well done, Aditi. Well done, Leffy. Don't touch it with the tip of a barge pole. Is used for transporting goods. A barge is a long vessel that normally goes on a canal that used to be pulled by a horse. So don't touch it with a 10-foot barge pole. It's 10 foot. It's a 10 foot barge pole. <laughs> but very often they just say, don't touch it with a barge pole. I wouldn't touch it with a, with a barge pole. That's, that's very good. How long is a piece of string? A barge pole is normally about 10 feet because the canals are not normally that deep because they've been dug by, by hand. It's 10 feet. So well done, Nathaniel, Oksana, Aditi and Leffy. Okay, don't, don't touch it with a barge pole. Okay, now this next one's got a little bit of grammar to it as well. I like this next one. So, I never see any progress. Don't touch it with a boat hook. Okay, a boat hook. Okay, Rupa, a 10 foot barge pole, a 3 meter barge pole. Notice here foot is acting as a modifier in the um, thing. So for example a, a 10 minute lesson. Not a 10 minutes lesson, a 10 minute lesson. And that's the point. Um, who was that who asked this? Uh, okay, no, that's fine. That's fine, Rupa. Or a three seat sofa. When the noun acts as an adjective, we don't put it, we don't give it an S and make it in the plural. Wow, I've got a million answers here now. A 10 foot pole, that's true, Nathaniel, as well. Okay, so don't. Hardly ever do I see any progress. That's great, SSV. There is hardly any progress. Hmm. I would, Oksana. I see har I see hardly any progress. Um. Hardly do I see any progress. Good, Vitali. Hardly do I ever see. Good, Manji. Hardly do I see. That's great, Lucia. Hardly do I see. Well done, Hadi. 
Hardly have I ever seen. Not never. Hardly is negative, therefore hardly have I ever, Manu. Hardly any progress do I see. Good work, Lionheart. Sorry, Renyard. Hardly do I see. Yes, Lionheart. Hardly had I seen. That's fine, Rupa. Hardly could you see. That's great, uh, Valentine. And oh, I've just lost my place. Um, hardly do I see. Great Vaishak. Hardly do I ever see from Ollie. Good. I hardly ever see. That'll do fine, Patricia. Hardly do I see any visible progress. Good Aditi. Hardly ever do I see. Great Nora. Or hardly do I see. Yeah. Yeah. Are you... Are you working hard or hardly working? There's a huge difference, Nathaniel, and I think you know it. Hardly do I see any progress. Hardly anything has been done. Okay, I love it, but Leffy. Okay, hardly ever have I seen. Hardly do I ever see. That's good, Jack. Hardly and never are similar. But notice, hardly is already negative. Therefore, hardly ever, never. Yeah, um, hardly is a negative word. Hardly ever do I see. Good. Hi, Sagad. Great to have you. Hardly, barely, scarcely. So let me write an answer here. Hardly do I ever see any progress. I hardly see any progress so notice when the hardly is the first word a negative adverb we get this inversion do I ever when it's not when it's the second word I hardly see we don't get the inversion hardly have I ever seen that's the idea Manu that's wonderful okay so It's a lovely example of chiasmus. Thank you very much for pointing that out, Vitali. I love it. Hardly can I find a Native American to speak with. It. Safula. Great to have you, Safula. First time. Chiasmus. It's a rhetor rhetorical device. Um, I would look, it, look up chiasmus in... Um, in internet. I've got a video on it as well. It's like an inversion. Okay, this is very, very good. Greeting Sherwin. Lovely to see you. Okay, so good work from Vitali, from Leffy, from Jack. That would work, SSV. Mukul, lovely to see you. Well done, Renyard. And Oksana, well done. And Manji and Vaishak, good, good, good. The position of hardly is absolutely essential. Rupa, hardly do I see inversion. I hardly see no inversion. The position of the hardly is everything. Yeah, if it's the first world word, then it, ca it causes an inversion. Okay, cr cranny. A cranny is like a crack or a hole. Yeah, I think you're... Yes, a cranny. A, a, a spider could live in a cranny. It's like a crack in a rock. Very good, Lucia. I've looked around for it. That's great, Sherwin. Well done, Hadi. Yeah. Okay, nook and corner. We normally use the phrase nook and cranny. I haven't, le I haven't left a single stone unturned. Or, Renyard, I have left no stone unturned. Notice, I, whoops, I have left no stone unturned. If you can, use no adjective, yeah? As, as opposed to haven't. So instead of haven't, have left no, yeah? A cranny. A cranny is a crack. It's a crack in the rock. Every nook and cranny, every nook and corner. Yes, Aditi. Zubs. Lovely to have you, Zubs. Very good, Patricia. 
I have hardly have I looked. I, I hardly have looked. I have hardly looked. I've looked hardly. Yes, Rupa, it can, it can go anywhere in the predicate. Yes. <laughs> I've looked for VG everywhere. Yeah? You've looked for him in every nook and cranny. I have been looking, or I have looked for it in every nook and cranny. To search high and low, that's a very nice synonym, uh, Lucia. I've looked for it in every nook and cranny. And, yeah, I'm going to put this to search high and low for Lucia as well. I have searched high and low it's got the same idea search with an a okay let's continue oh yes okay i think i'm going to do these two as a pair so she said i must do it and then the second one In each site, in every place, in every nook and cranny. Okay. Yeah. Highways and byways. <clears throat> I've been down all the highways, every highway and byway looking for this. I've looked far and wide. That works very, very nice, um, uh, Renyard. Yeah, so the first one is fine, but the second one isn't SSV. Okay, she ordered that I do it. The order is easy. Almost Valentine. She ordered it to be done by me. Okay, so I'm going to accept both of Lucia's. She insisted it be done by me. I wanted to put this on here as well. Yeah, so she insisted that it must be done. She insisted it must be done by me. That would work, Rupert. She ordered, insisted it be done by me. She ordered, that's fine, Oksana. And Jack as well. She ordered it be done by me. Good, Ollie. These, this is, these are quite difficult structures, Nathaniel. She ordered that it be done by me. It be done, man, Nathaniel, is a present subjunctive um, structure. Manji, thank you so much. That is so, so kind of you. Wow, thank you, Manji. Okay, so she ordered that it be done by me, by Aditi. She suggested... She insisted that it be done by me is good. She ordered the work to be done by me works for Mukul. Um, where am I? I'm lost again. Okay. She insisted it be done by me. That's great, Hadi. She insisted that it be done. Well done, Zubs. That it should be done by me. Good Manu. And Jack. Thank you. Thank you, Jack. That's the first one who, that's the first answer with insisted on. Well done, Jack. Okay, nearly Renyard. She ordered that it be done by me. She ordered that I should do it. She insisted on my doing it. That's very, very good, Hadi. I love it. And Aditi as well. Ordered it done by me. That's a good one, Nathaniel. That would work. It done. She ordered it done. It be done. She ordered it done by me. That's very good, Nathaniel. She ordered the food and insisted it be paid for by me. Yeah. It be paid by me. She insisted that it be done by me. She insisted on having it done by me. That's very... Who was that? That's Ollie. On it being done by me. Yeah. So, she ordered that it be done by me. That's okay. That's good, Patricia. And 
She insisted on my doing it. Thank you again, Manji. That is so kind of you. Yeah. She pressed that I do it. That would work, Sherwin. So, she insisted on it being done by me. Well done, Vitali. Well done, Vitali. Tatanya, Tatanya, great to have you as well. It's lovely to see you, Tatanya. Okay. Yeah. Um, so, let me... So, she ordered that it be done by me. We can put a should here. This is a present subjunctive. She ordered that it should be done by me. She insisted on me doing it. That's very good, Manji. You've got both of these. Well done. That's both... Uh, insisted on the stuff being done by me. That's it, Patricia. That's it. So, well done. You're starting to get this, all of you, now. That's it. So, she insisted on my doing it. But that doesn't end in, end in by me, does it? So, she insisted on it being done by me. I'm not keen on moving to Barcelona. I wouldn't be keen either. She insisted on on it being done by me. Well done, Vitali. There was who was this who first? Uh, there was Ollie who got this as well. Oh, thank you for the donation, Manji. What can I say? That is so kind of you. Okay, so she insisted on it being done by me. She insisted on my doing it okay notice this it being done nothing ssv it's a big city i don't like big cities yeah <laughs> and well we, we see too many too many brits in uh, barcelona maybe well done ibrahim well done ibrahim she insisted on it being done by me well done Huh. She insisted on having it done by me. That would definitely work, Nora. She insisted on having it done by me. That's that's lovely. I love it. Both Madrid, Madrid, Madrid menos, eh, Manu? Keen on, exactly. Okay, so this one's quite easy. This is one, one, one uh, people of your high level should know. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Manji. That is so kind of you. Okay, well done, SSV. Well done, Vitali. Well done, Renyard. Well done, Jack. Well done, Oksana. And Lucia and Vaishak and Rupa. Well done, all of you. Okay. That's it, Mukul. Well done. And Manji. Thank you, Manji. Ollie, thank you. And Lionheart, well done. Yeah. You need to go to the middle of nowhere, SSV. And where you are, I'm sure. Okay, so Nora, that's the idea. Well done. Well done, Hadi. Thank you, Leffy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Out of Bezos's pocket and into mine. Thank you, Leffy. That's really kind of you. So thank you both you and Leffy. And Manji, I mean. Okay. Money doesn't grow on trees. It doesn't flourish on trees. You need to use the grow, Sherwin. I like the idea of flourish, but grow, grow, it's grow. Okay, I'm um, so well done, Renyard. Well done, Manu. And Zubs. Well done, Zubs and Patricia. Yeah. It's harder to get than chopping down a tree. Yes. Well done, Aditi. El Nadi, thank you. It's great to have you. Thank you, Leffy. Yeah, today's today's been a lot of new, difficult stuff. That's great. That's the idea. I've been trying to push you. Today I've made it real hard. So, Ibrahim, exactly, is hiding high up in the trees. Money doesn't grow on trees. <laughs> I don't have a money tree at home. I love it, Mukul. 
and Tatiana, well done. There. <laughs> okay. So, money does not grow on trees. Hiding in trees. <laughs> That's it, Nathaniel. The one in your language. Thank you, Jack. A money minting machine. <laughs> okay, so one more to finish up with then. This is the last one. This is the last one for today. I see this situation too often. Yeah. We can make money as easily as picking leaves from trees. It looks like Malayalam to me, Rupa, but I'm not sure. It could be Tamil as well. <laughs> it's definitely South India, though. Yeah. Um, so, except in Donald Trump's house. I love it, Man Manu. All do I see this situation. You need Malayalam. Well done, Leffy. First one in there. Well done, Leffy. Well done, Nathaniel, as well. All the time do I see. That'll work, Nora. All the spectators do is see this situation. Too often do I see. That's the idea, Nora. Notice, all too often, two causes an inversion at the beginning of a sentence. That's it. Much, much more. Uh, so, where am I? Much too often do I see exactly Vitali. Hmm. Well done, Ollie. All too often do I see. All the time I do see. Poor. Um, you, you, let's see. All too often. All too often do I see. All too often do I see this. That's it, Manu. All too often do I see, well done Manji, and Aditi. All too often do I see, good, and Lucia. Too often do I see exactly Tatiana. So we need the, the first bit with this. All too often, that's it, Hadi. Sanjit, my glasses are really, really hard. All too often have I seen. Well done, Patricia. Well done, Patricia. That's really good. So, all too often do I see this situation. All the time I see. That works at Ibrahim. Yeah, so all too often do I see. Um, too often do I see. This too at the beginning gives us an inversion. Well done, Manu. That's the idea. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, time for us to stop. So, we will continue more tomorrow. So, next stream tomorrow, uh, Friday, at 1 p.m. UK time. Yes! That's it, Jack. Too many times do I see. Too expensive a car is this for me to buy. Too long a journey is this to make every day. So, thank you, Jack. Much too often have I been witness to this. That's brilliant, Vitali. I love the example. 
Okay, so thanks Leffy, thanks for the donation. Thanks Vitali, thank you Manji as well for the donation. So special thanks to uh, Manji and Leffy. Thank you Nora, thank you Tatiana. Um, who else? Thank you Manji, yes, thank you Manji again. Thank you Vitali and Rupa and who else? And Manisco and Jack and Rupa and Ibrahim and thank you Nathaniel, thank you Patricia, thank you Hadi, Sa thank you Sanjit, thank you Tatiana, thank you Lucia, thank you Renyard, thank you Aditi, thank you Jack, thank you Sherwin, thank you Renyard and Ollie and Valentine and Zubs and who else is there to thank? I'm sure there are more people out here. Oh, Vaishak, thank you. And El Nari, it's lovely to see you. And thank you, Hadi and Manuel Gordillo. And Tatiana and Mokul and, and Nathaniel. Yes, yes, yes. And thank you, oh, and thank you, Lionheart as well. I nearly missed you, Lionheart. And SSV as well. So, thank you all for coming. It's been brilliant having you. I hope to see you all um, tomorrow, one o'clock.